Let's, let's put it on the hiatus. Y'all think about it for a second. Ain't no tag. <laughs> what I've been, I'm not even a female, but I've had this discussion with females. I have female friends. A lot of females, uh, especially no, you know, disrespect to no other communities, but in the black community in L.A., uh -huh. a lot of the black women will come up to me and say, you know, how, how do you how you feel about dating in L.A.? You know, just that's mm -hmm. just that's what an uh, issue. And I'm like, uh, I mean, I don't have to worry about it. I'm I'm good. You know, like I don't, I'm good. And then they'll be like, oh, yeah, well, I think it's real hard, you know, dating in L.A., you know, it's kind of hard to find a good guy, especially black men, da 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 So I think that might be an issue that you you, you, you guys might experience. Is, is, is that true? Is that? I hear that a lot, but it's not really just in L.A., but it's, it's extra. It's, it's extra, extra in L.A., L.A. yeah. It's extra just because everybody want, like, everybody want to be a savage for some reason. But right. here my, in L.A. The thing I complain about is quality time, because that's my love language. Mm -hmm. Quality time. Okay. <laughs> quality time. So it's like, huh? <laughs> Do you see what he's doing? I'm not playing with because he was saying something about you know like like he works a lot so if you don't have the time I get it but also like let me know yeah I'm talking to you specifically. Uh, this is real a real conversation. <laughs> it is a real conversation. So I was like, oh yeah, because that sounds like me. I just uh, I, I just want to make sure you know like I'm here for you. I want you to be here for me. So like talk to me. Yeah. Let me. Yeah. Winning. Fellas, what are the number one thing that women complain to you guys about? What do they complain about? <laughs> women com complain about oh, he was time. Exactly <laughs> what she just said. Time. Okay. You Money. Know? But my whole thing Not is... Not for me, but... Others. If you, if you are complaining about a, a, a man that's focused and busy, but you still want that bag from him... No, mm. no, because there are no. independent women so, up here. Men, you don't make time for what you want. Don't try, exactly. Oh, so you can definitely get oh, the bag. What if you got the cow potato? What are you going to do with the cow potato? You can definitely do that. He's always you know there for me. No, no, because we're going to take that Guess bag and You're not the only one that's focused. You're not the only one that's focused. We're focused too, but it's like, let me hear from you. But your emotional attachment to the attention that you need, we are trying to fulfill that, but we also trying to fulfill the bag. So. Which, so one are you you trying? Which one do you want? Which one do you want? I feel like that's the human shit that you talking about. And it's not even just How? a call, phone a call shit? that you're asking about. You know, it's way deeper than you a know, phone I call. Do you feel, do women stress you out a lot about your time? Are you really busy or is it like they're not a priority? <laughs> Well, busy. <laughs> Very right. busy. Busy. Not that busy. Because you know what I'm saying? When we get this bag, we get this million dollars, and we're buying these houses, and these cars for the boo boos. Y'all ain't going to be saying no. Um, I don't need no man to buy something for me, okay? Right. We're working that's, together. And that's what I want. <laughs> Let's talk about this. Uh, this is a big question you should ask about. How about 50 50? I love 50, that. 50 50 what? 50, 50 50 everything, With man and women. I love that. Okay. Oh, oh I love you. Can I ask y'all a question? Have y'all ever dated? No. no. I'm feeling but it something. But it feels right. Here. It feels yeah. something. I'm feeling something. You feel something. Yeah. yeah. Are you blushing? No. Yeah. We can blush, baby. Let her blush. She blushes. Chill out, man. It's the makeup. <laughs> the makeup is hiding the blush. What are we talking about? So 50 50, how do y'all feel about that for real, though? Well, me personally. Why, the way I was brought up, my parents, you know, are still together, same parents, so I'm, I'm fortunate enough to have that. Can I get a clap for that? Amen. <laughs> That's different. That's different. <laughs> you know, and I was able, I was fortunate enough to see my parents uh, develop a partnership. Now, it probably wasn't 50-50 because my father is the type of man who basically he made his money and he just gave it to my mom. They take care of the bills. They just give me enough to play some numbers and stuff. So <laughs> probably wasn't 50-50. <laughs> but it's close to the mentality of we come together as a union. Mm -hmm. Now, you have some women out there that believe that the man should do 80. Hey. And you know the man, the woman do twenty. Mm -hmm. And my whole theory on that is, you know, well, what's the difference between you and a daughter that I could have? Wow. You okay. know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I, I might as well just be single, and 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 be <laughs> without the stress. Yeah. Now you're talking financially. Yeah. If we're talking about if the man's supposed to do everything, financially. Financially, what? My my thing is, what does the woman bring 
to a partnership. How do you feel? Okay, I'm sure you saw with your parents, you said it wasn't 50-50, mm -hmm. so maybe your dad had more of the money, but I'm sure your mom, what she did that was very, very valuable, mm -hmm. wasn't a dollar amount, like raising the kids, for the parents, no, that, that's keeping different. the house. That's different. Oh, she's going to hit me with this. She's going to hit me. But I feel no, like a lot of times we, we don't really value that like we should because like that's not a no, that's job, but it, a lot of times that's just as hard, if not mm -hmm. harder, right. than the bringing home of money, so I think we forget about that. And, I think and it, shouldn't, it shouldn't be 50-50. We shouldn't should minimize what Let me retract that. 50-50 is, is rough, is rough. But maybe in the beginning, uh -huh. I, I the just have a process. thing with the mentality. Right. No, and I feel you. I, and I don't in the think, beginning. I think ladies, we do ourselves a disservice when we come out, like, they have to pay for everything and I'm not lifting a finger. I think that you kind of put them in a position to feel like they run shit, mm -hmm. right? And I think we need to, like, still hold our own. But I don't think, I don't know about this whole 50-50 thing. I'm a little bit traditional in some ways. Yeah. And until we're actually making the same money as y'all, I don't even want to hear nothing about no 50-50 right. on the money. Okay. Because we're still not getting that. paid like y'all. Right. We're not. What you mean? I ain't getting I'm not paid like us, but oh, y'all are running. Y'all are running. Y'all are running. I mean, I'm the right boss, now. but I'm just yeah. talking about society. And it's and still not getting paid you, as much. You are one of many, though. Right now, like, women are running the game. Yeah. Especially in the Hollywood industry. I mean, that's just what it is. Anything, you got Ava. You got Lena, yeah. you got Issa. Yes. Anything in it with a uh means a check. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Like, so, so I don't know. You saying women ain't winning. You know what I mean? Women is winning. What a, what a camera at? And what a camera still not getting paid as much as our winning. male, like, we still not getting paid as much as the man. This is something we can't get over. You might it's not. not so get over okay. We can't get over that. Okay, listen, you might not be. We had to do a little bit more facts for research for this to be in this uh, debate. Right. So. But for the, sake of the de <laughs> for the sake of the debate, we're going to take their fact as factual information. Yeah. Okay, I mean. so even if you're not making the adequate money that you feel, you know, is, is, uh, equivalent, equivalent to your to your platform. Equal. You still well, equal, equal, mm -hmm. equivalent. You know, mm -hmm. same thing, interchangeable. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. tomato, tomato. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> even if you don't feel like that it's equal, um, you still have a platform. You still have power. The, the, you know, you still have influence. Mm -hmm. You know, you still have an impact. You know. So with that being said, woman, you think about women in 1950, 1920, and, and, and behind. It took a long time for y'all to even get to this point. No facts. So. Let's just recognize and, and, and have a blessing of recognition to the fact that you guys have made, y'all excel at the end of the day. Y'all went from here to here, you know. Right now, we might be, we might be here and, and making more money, but y'all are here at the end of the day right now as far as what it goes. He's telling you to get over it. He's telling right. you to get over it. That's really what he just said. I mean, like, all that was Which like, means 50-50. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that means, brother. No, he really just I'm said really you have that. the platform, but yeah, you might not have the pay. As long as you have the platform, be, right. you know, sit on your no, corner and be no. cute. We're going to continue the great fight. Y'all ever <laughs> seen that, 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 that little red do-rag with the woman? She like... Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I think it gets frustrating to hear that because, like, you know, in some regards, like, I hear a lot of men say that they want it to be 50-50, and I think eventually we should be there, right? But there's a lot of ways where we're still, it's still not equal. Like, even if we dated the way y'all dated, we would be judged in a whole different way. And then people got, I had a conversation, a guy was like, well, you're supposed to value your bodies, we're not. And I'm like, okay, so it's like, y'all can't, we, I won't mm -hmm. even just say men, we, can't pick and choose when it's 50 50. We're gonna be 50 50, let that thing be across the damn board, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Then it's right. there. Very true. Because I wanna hear, like, okay, you're gonna get less money, but then you have to still behave better than me because you're a woman. Right. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. that's why I think mm -hmm. where it gets frustrating sometimes. That's true. But I feel, I think we should carry our own weight, both of us. Yes. You know, ladies, well, there's a lot of power when carry, you carry your own weight. Because mm -hmm. you can't tell you what to do. Right. <laughs> and that's what my daddy taught me. He was just like, you need to make your own because don't ever let a man run you. I'm like, never. Okay. Ever. Right. Well, right. See, if you date her, that's what's you're gonna deal with. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> a, man, a man, a man doesn't doesn't. I won't. I won't say run. I, I not have this conversation a lot um, in general. But do you do you think that a man should lead like the traditional way of? Because you said you're a little traditional. You know. I am. So do you think that? He, okay. So with it being fifty fifty, do you st would you be passive? We talking about passive aggression. You know. Would you be passive and let the man lead like a man's supposed to do? The question is, Supposed can a man lead in 50-50? Now that's a new question. So, I don't feel like a man can lead doing the same exact thing that I'm doing, like giving 50-50. Like, if a man's gonna lead, you need to lead and lead a little more with, as far as bills or picking up dinners or whatever. I mean, if you wanna be the man, but if we just gonna be like best friends and taking care of things half and half, then... You roommates. Right, we roommating. Okay. Okay. I just feel like that's building an empire for yourself, though. Like, 
Like, it's honestly like, okay, if you got this bill, then I'm going to go ahead and pick up this bill. You feel me? It's like that's the 50-50 thing for me. I think mm -hmm. what I'm honestly looking for, since I brought up this new category, I see. <laughs> uh, just partnership. partnership. Maybe it's not really 50-50. It's just it's knowing that you have a woman that every now and then can bring something to the table, mm -hmm. not just be waiting for a handout. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's fair. I've been in relationships where I made more money and the man didn't, but I still gave him that respect to lead in the ways where I think, like, I wouldn't be with him if I didn't trust in his judgment, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? So I trust him to, like, kind of, like, know, like, what he's talking about, and I have that respect for him. So I would never be disrespectful to someone I'm with if he doesn't make as much money as me. Right. Because right. I'm obviously with him for other things that he has that may be their shortcomings that I have. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And we have to, like, make sure we keep that, like, Ladies, if you're with someone and you make more money than him, don't be disrespectful because you have more money. Just like fellas, if you have more money than the woman you're with, you can't think, well, that means I can like fuck everybody I want to fuck because I make more money. All right. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like we still have to have our respect for each other Agreed. and not let it be based just on money. I think we, we kind of like missed the mark with that.